Hi guys, welcome back to another video of Car Help For You. So today's video is basically, um, it's a follow up from the previous one. So the previous one we changed the fuel pump and the car, it started working. This customer got lucky, he got one from a scrapyard and put one into the car and he was lucky it started working. Obviously with cars like Chevrolet and Devo, they are harder to get fuel pumps. Especially with this one, he was looking at around £180. He went to a scrapyard and picked it up for 40 quid, so he got an absolutely bargain. Anyway, um, we put that in, the car fired straight up, we drained all the fuel out, put fresh fuel in for him. And now he wanted the oil changing and the spark plugs, etc. So basically a service. So I just thought I'd show you where the spark plugs are in this car. So basically, how to get access to spark plugs is very easy. Normally you'd have a cover here on the belt. This car doesn't have one. That wouldn't interfere because it'd just stop here. But um, if you do have one, don't worry. It will, it's the same method. So basically what you need to do is you need to take your oil cap off. And as you can see, it's got a bit of smoke coming out of it because the car was just on a few minutes ago. Anyway, you need to take these out. If I take one out, I'll show you what I use to take it out. So that's the length of the actual screw. And it is just like an Allen key, really, but we've got one of those bits that's connected to the screwdriver. They are usually a bit tight, so you could use a socket set to put a bit of pressure on. Obviously, if you've got an Allen key, it's even better. You can put a lot more pressure on with an Allen key, better than a screwdriver anyway. But this one's they're all pretty loose, so that's working there. And uh, before anyone says anything, yeah, I apologise about the gloves. Two different colours, but what happened while we were doing... Uh, some other work on the car, one of the gloves ripped and this is the quickest one to hand and anyway when you're working on a car who cares about gloves as long as you've got your own safety so anyway guys if we can just get this final screw open so that's open there and when I opened that one the cover itself actually started wobbling a bit you can see it starts moving now literally all you've got to do is just lift upwards watch the wires and that's it the cover's off so we'll put the cover to the side and the spark plugs are one, two, three, and four. And they're very simple to remove. All you've got to do is just pop it and just check that there's no oil, etc. there. Pop it, just check there's no oil, etc. there. Spark plug is down there. All you've got to use is a spark plug extension socket. This one's magnetic. All it does is it goes in, sticks on down there, put a socket key in the end, and we change all four. So basically now, you know where they are. Changing it's quite easy. All you've got to do is just take it out, put the new one in, and job done so anyway guys if this helped you please like share and subscribe thank you